what's up guys and um, welcome back to my youtube channel so in this video i'm going to be showing you how you can easily generate your apk bundle or generate your apk file once you use an android studio to convert your website to an android app so i recently dropped a video on how you can do that so kindly check the link in the description or click the link above this video right now so in this particular video after doing all the conversion and all that so i'm going to be showing you how you can easily generate your apk file using android studio but before i get started if you are new to my channel please kindly do well to hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification so that anytime i release a new video like this you can be able to get a notification for that so if you are also a return subscriber i also welcome you back to my youtube channel all right, so um, generating your APK bundle is not that much easy tax. So you just need to do once you have fully deployed your app. Let me say you have um, you are done creating your app or converting your website to an Android app. So all you just need to do, you just need to um, go to your file. Let me say just go to the navigation um, menu. Once you go to the navigation menu, you just need to look for the build option. So search for the build option. You are just going to be locating it at the build option. So once you see the build option, you are going to be seeing generating um APK file. So so you are going to be seeing it. So just select the the APK option. So once you select the APK option, then then a new pop up is um going to be displaying to you. So in this pop up now, you just need to you know let me say select um the kind of app that you want to build is it an apk bundle or and uh, let me say normal apk so just normal apk is the one that you can install on your android device but apk bundle is the one that you can just um upload on um or let me say on your android um your android play store so um i have already generated my app now but if you just look at this now my app is generated automatically um i just need you to i just wanted to guide you guys through the process so i just going to be doing another method so this method is by signing in so you just need to choose this um sign in apk bundle so by signing in this apk bundle you just need to give it a digital signature so um you just need to select the type of um, apk that you want to generate you can see an apk bundle and an apk so an APK bundle, like, like I already said, is the one that you can upload on your Google Play Store. So what I'm just going to be generating the, uh, let me say the APK, which is the one that can install in my phone now. So by doing that, I just need to click on the next button. So in this side, you need to create your keystone. So by creating your keystone, if you don't have one, you just need to click on that create new create new so once you click on create new you are just going to be you know following all the information and the necessary um information just input your your information there so once you're done you're done inputting your information you just need to click on the um the create file and it's going to be created um for you so once you are done creating it you select your file you where you want the file to be generated to you can either see release or a box so it's a release file so you just choose the release option so once you choose the release option you just need to click on build and your app is just going to be building right away you can look at this now my app is now built and it's fully built so if i just get this app now install it on my phone this app is going to be working perfectly so this app is going to be working perfectly you can either build your apk bundle by signing in just click on this sign in apk so once you click on that sign in apk everything um you just need to select the apk bundle and you are good to go so this is how you can be able to generate your apk file if you find this video useful please don't forget to hit the subscribe button turn on the notification so see you in my next video